This is George from High Tech Legion. After purchasing Indylink's OCZ has pushed the barefoot controller right to the forefront of performance SSD controllers on the market. Uh, the Barefoot 3 controller is present in their new top-of-the-line drive that we have here, the Vector. We have a Vector 256 megabyte drive here. As you can see, it comes in a powder blue, a uh, powder blue box as well. And the box quickly tells you uh, things you would already know and expect. SATA 3, of course, 6 gigabits per second. MLC NAND flash memory, that is IMFT NAND flash in there, 25 nanometer. Uh, Indolinks infused, as we say, the Indolinks uh, Barefoot 3 controller inside. Trim support, 3.5 inch SSD adapter for desktops is included. And a Cronus uh, True Image HD software is also included. That has to be done through a download. There is no disk included, but not a problem. Comes with the uh, activation code. Going around the back, you just get a quick blurb on the back about uh, the Vector being a true performance computing experience. Taking a look at the Vector itself. First thing you notice about it, it's incredibly heavy for an SSD. Very solidly built, uh, very solid aluminum housing. Once again, powder blue with the black OCZ uh, technology on the bottom, Indolinks infused. And OCZ sticker on the back, as you can see, SATA connectors up top for power and data. Uh, it is a 7 millimeters form factor, as you can see right here, so it is slim, will fit in an Ultrabook without a problem. Uh, the metal casing is going to be good as far as heat dissipation, especially in an Ultrabook or a tight environment. Um, one of the amazing things about the new Indolinks Barefoot 3 controller is the uh, read and write endurance uh, it does have. Uh, what it boasts is 550 megabytes per second on sequential reads, 530 megabytes per second on sequential writes. But the thing about it being, the Barefoot, doesn't, barefoot controller doesn't lose speed over time. It will sustain those rates. So you're not going to see a drop off after a couple of minutes, which you see with, which, uh, with, most, with most controllers. Uh, also, staggeringly, you get 100,000 IOPS in a 4K write and 95,000 IOPS in a 4K, uh, I should say in a 4K read, and 95,000 IOPS in a 4K write. Um, very low power consumption, so perfect for Ultrabooks, and comes with a five-year warranty. OCZ did a lot of field work with uh, the Vector. A lot of test samples went out, and they were used quite a bit. So they are giving you a five-year warranty, or 36.5 terabytes of uh, writes, total writes, um, as your warranty. That is quite a warranty for a new chip, to say the least. Uh, that breaks down to about 20 gigab uh, gigabytes per day of writes over a five-year period. Heading inside of the Vector. You can see, got some thermal interface material right on the case, so it does use the very, very solid, as I said, case uh, for heat conductivity. Going to help out a lot in tight spaces, Ultrabooks. You can see Indolinks barefoot controller surrounded by the IMFT um, MLC flash. Um, it is rebranded with the OCZ name and logo on each of the flash chips. And going around the back, get more of the flash chips. Really a beautifully laid out circuit board. Very nicely put together. Um, uh, double sided. And as you can see, just really well made with absolutely precise um, component adherence to the circuit board. Great looking inside. Uh, strangely up top we've got what looks like a second set of connectors. Uh, don't know what they're for, but might just be for testing in factory or whatnot. So great looking on the inside as well as the outside. Included in the box with the Vector. I love my OCC S uh, SSD sticker. The Cronus True Image software. Activation code and download instructions. Installation manual. Obviously very brief, multi-language. And three and a half inch two and a half inch uh, desktop adapter for the drive. So the Vector comes as a very nice package. Uh, what you don't see here uh, for a limited time, OCZ on the 256 gigabyte model and the 512 gigabyte model is including a free uh, download for Far Cry 3, the first person shooter. So that will be included for a limited time, begins on February 6, 2013. So, the OCZ Vector delivers top-of-the-line performance. I mean, the IOPS are just staggering at 100,000 on the 4K random read and uh, 95,000 on the 4K write. 
uh, as well as really incredible sequential speeds at 550 megabytes per second on the right or on the read and uh, 530 on the right. Beautiful package, really really solid case as I said, and of course absolutely top of the line performance on the market in today's day and age.